welcome back to Mad Lizard RC. So, brought out the jet stream, got something new I've been in testing lately. One is this weird funky hat. Yeah, I know it looks silly, but there's a purpose. Then inside, you'll see where um, bilge water pickup right into the um, intake of the jet drive system. So, you know, in testing, I did it in my hot tub and pulled out a little bit of water. It's not a lot really quickly, but over time, it'll pull out some water. So, first things first, make sure she's plugged in, but she's not. Turn on radio. Steering. All right. First, let's check this thing. So we're take it. And usually within, boom, we have some going. And then real quick, usually, so this hat is made to kind of help the boat self ride. Yeah, it's gonna collect a little bit of water inside, but that's why we have this little pump here. Well, that guy there. So we know it self rides, yes, with the new kind of layout, it does hold to the right a little bit more. First time being on the water. Which I can remove a trim tab down a little bit to compensate. You know, I got my intake on it. Let's try this one more time. So we're gonna take it, simulate a rollover. There we go. She's upside down, she's back over. Jeez. So I can, you know, this is the first outing with the hat. This is the first outing with, you know, a couple of the modifications. So a little bit tuning. I think I gotta move a trim tab down a little bit. But it's pretty choppy out though. Now let's see if we can get this thing to flip. Now I don't have a recovery system. So if I figure if I do it right here, I should be okay. Well, I could always just launch it off that. I know sometimes you go, go fast like this and then, there we go. Oh yeah. All right. She up and over again, boom. All right. I am confident now. Just gotta trim it just a little bit more on the trim tabs. I don't have any tools with me. Wife took off to the store. And so this was just a, find a good battery. Okay. Okay. Sideways. 
There we go. Definitely need to put a trim tab down, but. That's only because of the weight. Um, forget which button I have it set up for. That's break. There we go. So uh, it's setting the trim. Okay, try this one more time. There we go, we got a full rollover. Now it's almost impossible to get this thing to flip. Okay, one last time. An adjustment of a trim tab, but just slightly down. But you know what? I have something here. You know, since I've been rolling it a lot, you know, of course, there's gonna be some water like normal. You got a little bit of water, but that's okay. You know, it's not like a perfect system in there, but I'm sure. Something else can be adapted, made work. All right, one more time. One more flip chest. Ah. There we go. Now we're fully up and over. It does take a second because what happens is water does got to go into the pole a little bit. And that's why I have that water pickup. So it fills up a little bit, and then it will self come around. Yeah, I definitely need to fix that trim tab. But success, I finally have something going. Does look funny, but God, it works. It's kind of fun. Yay, I'm happy I got to solve on something. Ooh, jump, oh, missed. Okay. Bilge pump needs a little more work, but you know what? That's enough to ride it over and bring it back in at least to pour the water off out. So one more time, one more time. This is too much fun. Do 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 do. 
Yep, and it fills up just a little bit, just enough, and we're up and over. Anyways, so that's the new hat. It does look slightly funky, but you know what? I'll take funkiness over having to play fetch. Okay. Like it? Perfect. All right. Thanks for watching.